Hello everyone, in this video we're going to show you how to manually close the roof on an A5 Cabriolet in event of failure. So to start off, we're going to open all the windows, just take the key, turn the ignition on and press the window open button. Once all the windows are open, then just uh, take the key out of the ignition and keep that on the dashboard and hold the roof close button down for 10 seconds. This is just to release any hydraulic pressure that may be left in the system. Now, next is to open the tailgate. So we'll just confirm it's unlocked by pressing the unlock button. Let's open the tailgate. And now, according to the manual, I'm using this for illustration purposes, but there's a little catch here to unlock the lock for the rear deck lid. Now, unfortunately, the little tang is actually broken on this vehicle, but we can still open it by getting your finger in and pushing the lever up just over here. Now it's not very easy to see. Maybe there we are. It's not that one. There, just over there. So now you've unlocked the rear lock. You come around on this side and this lever is broken, but it can still open it by pushing the top forward and pulling the bottom towards you that ram over there will move at the back just over there we'll do the same on the driver's side and you can see this a lot better so notice this ram over here when you pull the lever the ram goes up now you've done that you can then notice that you will be able to lift the rear deck lid up now you've got to be careful here so that doesn't make contact with the tailgate. Now we've got to open the rear deck lid. So you lift it up and make sure it doesn't make contact with the tailgate. Bring that up and you just wedge your hand underneath. Then bring the tailgate down nice and slow, making sure your hands don't get stuck and close the tailgate. Then come to the center of the vehicle and pull this towards you, like that. Now, if you look at the vehicle on side elevation, you'll see the rear deck lid is open and you've got access to the roof. One thing we did forget to get was the manual key out the boot. So now we've opened the rear deck lid, you won't be able to access the tailgate. But what you do is you get the key blade out, put the key in the um, tailgate and turn it to open the tailgate. Make sure when that touches that, it's very nice and soft because you don't want to damage the paintwork. Now, the key actually is in here. So, Allen key, take that out and close the tailgate. Taking the key and putting that back with the rest of the fob. Let's take the roof out of the compartment. So, Although they say two people, we're going to do it as one person. Move the seat forward and take your shoes off. The main thing here is to make sure you pull the roof parallel. So, stand over the roof, grab it on either side and pull the roof out. If you've got a bad back, obviously don't do this by yourself. And bring the roof to the forward front of the vehicle. You will notice that the roof forks are actually still closed. We will open these and latch them into the windscreen. The cap has actually already been removed on here uh, and we don't have it. So if there is a cap there, just take it out with your nail or a screwdriver. And now we're gonna use this manual key. So you put that in the hex hole, you turn it anti-clockwise and the forks will actually start to open. Once the forks are fully open, bring the roof down and then turn it clockwise. And the forks will close, locking the windscreen on to the frame. Once the roof is closed, remove the key. You'll need this at the back now. 
Now we need to close the rear deck lid. So we'll start off by uh, lifting the rear glass back up. Now you've got to make sure you push this forward parallel. So I'm going to put my hand underneath and just move it forward. Nice and parallel. Let it come down. And now if we come around on this side, we need to remove the roof lining such that we can lock the tensioner. They say you use the manual key. You put that into this eyelet over here. Okay, well, maybe I should do a better job of that. You put that into this eyelet over here like this. Okay, and you pull such that it removes the trim of the plastic. And you pull that out. Oops. There's a little bit of dirt in there that came out. There's something bonded to this because I think the vehicle's had the rear glass bonded. Now this is off and this has already been clipped off on this vehicle and so is this. Uh, you pull that up all the way around. Be careful. Okay, and just put that on the inside. Now we'll go inside the vehicle to show you how to lock the rear glass down. So now we've got to lock the tensioner. Now they say you use the key and put it in here, but we've got to get it close first, yeah? So I just put my hand in and push that down like this. All right? And push the other lever up. And then once that's in position, you can then put the manual key in if you wish and finish it off, which is already locked. Again, we're going to lock this side. So we can use a manual key if you want to, but we're going to do it by hand. Um, you push this lever up and the one behind it down. And there you have it. You've successfully closed the roof on your A5 Cabriolet. Now, you won't be able to get this trim back in again, and that's because the vehicle needs to go for repair. That's obviously the reason why you've had to close it manually. We hope you found our video useful. If you have, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit like and share.